Hello and welcome to Book of Beasties Blue Day Journal, where we take a look at some of the wellbeing topics we've covered throughout the learning kit for us to note down in our journal. So you can refer back to them later on if you feel the need to boost your mood, take a break, or just want some positive inspiration. All you will need is your journal, you can use your fact file if you like and keep a dedicated Book of Beasties book and pens or pencils to write in the journal with. If you think it will be helpful, you can even keep the worksheets in the book to look back on. Throughout the Isle of Man Learning Kit, we looked at promoting more optimistic thinking, listing out pros and cons of any given situation and building a strong and positive network of supportive people. But these are our top three topics. Number one, appreciating differences. Diversity is beautiful. The fact that every single person is unique in their own way, with their own qualities, opinions, likes and dislikes is simply amazing. Our differences, be it cultural, visual or personal, make us who we are. And it is good to celebrate and learn to appreciate the wonderful tapestry of humanity. Culture encompasses our customs, traditions and beliefs. Our cultural backgrounds shape our identities and bring a richness to our lives and the whole world as a whole. It is so important to recognise that beauty, for example, comes in all shapes, sizes and colours. Visual differences can include our appearance, such as skin colour, eye shape or hair texture. All these differences make us unique and beautiful. And beyond culture and appearance, our personalities, talents and interests make us all distinct individuals. What do you think makes you different and unique? Here are our well-being wonderings. The fact that every person is unique is incredible. Our differences make us who we are as individuals. It is good to celebrate and learn about other people's differences. Number two, the five W's and one H. Being well informed allows us to better understand the world around us and interact with others in a more meaningful way. Being well informed allows us to better understand the world around us and interact with others in a more meaningful way. Being socially aware means being aware of the feelings, needs and perspectives of the people around us. Gathering information helps us gain insights into different cultures and beliefs and experiences for any given situation, we need to think about the five W's and the one H. See if you could guess what they are. Well, the five W's are who, what, why, where, when, and the one H is how. Gathering this information can help us see any situation more clearly. To improve our information gathering skills, we can read books, explore reliable online sources, and engage in discussions with diverse groups of people. It's important to critically evaluate information. And by that we mean really focus on the detail and consider different people's perspectives. By continuously seeking knowledge, we become more informed and socially aware individuals. Here are our well-being wonderings. Remember, who, what, why, where, when, how. Making sure we are well informed helps us have better interactions with the world around us. Improve our information gathering skills by reading and engaging with people from different backgrounds. Number three, affirmations. Sharing kind words with others doesn't cost a thing. And whilst it may be just a passing comment for us, what we say can have a big impact on other people. The same goes for if we say something negative, which is why we need to be so careful about what we say and how we say it to others. We can have the same effect on ourselves, which is why it is a good idea to say nice things about ourselves. These are called affirmations. And in the context of well-being, an affirmation is something we say often to ourselves to offer emotional support. Sometimes just seeing a positive action or beautiful scenery or a nice comment is a good enough thing to lift our spirits. Here are our well-being wonderings. What we say can have a big impact on people. Saying positive things about ourselves can have a positive impact on us. Affirmations can come in the form of words, situations, 
or places. See you next time.